What's up, y'all? It's your girl JK, and I'm back with another freaking video, y'all. Um, I've been wanting to film this video, but I just haven't, so here I am, y'all filming. I'm going to tell y'all, like, how I got my permit slash learning license and how you can get your permit slash learning license. And, yeah, a couple people asked me, like, people keep asking me, where you go to take your, do your stuff, what you do your stuff on? Or, um... Or I already told people and people are already following them. I need to get their license, which is a good thing because y'all need to be riding out here illegal. Like, stop being like everybody else and actually go do something different, you know? But yeah. Alright y'all, so to first to first start out, I took my I took an online course. I didn't take no um what they be taking? No actual class because it's just, I don't want to wake up and go to no class. I want to do stuff on my own time. When I want to do it, how long, it, however long I want to take to do it, you know? I like doing stuff on my own time. So, therefore, I did the online course at um, texasdriverschool.com. It'll be right there, whatever. But, yeah, I did it on texasdriverschool.com. It was like, it was very easy. Um, it didn't take long, like, yeah, took less than, i say, three months to get it. Yeah, so, yeah, it don't take long, and if you're the type of person that like to do stuff on your own time, when you want to do it, however long you want to take, you can do that with the online course. So, TexasDriverSchool.com, um, basically on there it's like, I think, 12 lessons, and after you complete the lesson, you basically can go to them and stuff. So it's like 12 lessons, but in each lesson, it's like many lessons in each lesson. So you have to watch these videos. You have to watch these videos of people that, um, like, basically telling their story or somebody family telling their story of people who had car accidents, you know, not being safe on the road. So... Yeah, those stories are actually kind of interesting. They will make you want to drive safe. Like, after those stories, y'all, I basically, like, corrected everything people do. Like, you're not supposed to do that. But, yeah. So, you're going to watch these little videos. Either you, um, inside of people's story, how they got in a car accident, how they die. Not how they die, because they died in a car accident. But, like, when they died and stuff. Then, after each video... You basically answer questions so they can know you're paying attention. And then also, it's not just videos of people um, getting in car accidents. Um, it's also them telling you like rules and regulations of the roadway, all this stuff. And you have to take, you know, a quiz after each, after each little video, you take a quiz. And... If you think you finna get on there and just basically rush and not listen to none of that stuff, no, y'all. It's timed. Each thing is timed. It's time you how long you can watch the video. You can't skip the video. So it's timed on that. Your quiz is timed. Because I think that makes sense for them to time it. Because some people just try to rush through it so they can get their stuff. But you have to actually pay attention. So each thing is timed, y'all. So don't think... If you just want, don't really want to pay attention, I wouldn't recommend because you have to pay attention. Don't try to rush because you can't really rush anyway because it's our time. And like after the middle, when you get to the middle, they send you this certificate, basically. And you got to keep the certificate, y'all. So, yeah, here's mine. Mine, I got mine, y'all. Your girlfriend got a license soon because I heard the DMV is open. Y'all know because of that quarantine and stuff, that corona, they was closed. But yeah, y'all, TexasDriverSchool.com is really, really, really easy as long as you're paying attention. And y'all, when you get your permit or before you get your permit, you have to actually want to do it because if you don't want to do it, then you're just going to fall asleep on the videos, fall asleep when they're talking, and basically fail the quizzes. After you fail the quizzes, you're not moving on. You're not moving on. You get a chance to retake it. And I think if you keep failing at this, um, however many times, you will get signed out and you will have to repay. This is why you have to pay attention because you probably will have to repay. I think it did say that. Oh, yeah. Awesome. If you think that, oh, yeah, let me get somebody to do my online. Let, let me get somebody to do my online stuff. 
yeah no that's not gonna happen unless you sing right by that person but other than that i don't recommend trying to cheat none of them because after i think oh yeah after each quiz y'all you gonna have to do this voice recognition thing and then every time you get a quiz you do a voice recognition and yeah if your voice is not the same every time baby they're gonna some i forgot what happened Dang, something happened. Oh, yeah, you get signed there, too. You have to call these people or whatever. So make sure y'all don't try to cheat. It's really very, very, very easy if you really want to do it. It's, I will very, 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 This is very, 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 very recommended because, like I said, if you like me, yeah, you need to do it online because that's best for us, you know? And what else can I tell you? Oh, yeah, okay, so after I finish my classes, not the class, yeah, the little online classes, whatever. I got my certificate thingies. And what else? Oh, it's this packet, too. It's this packet that you're going to receive with, like, how to do get your stuff. So it's this packet and this certificate. Then you can go to the DMV. I went to the DMV. I went to the freaking DMV. Then, like, you get them your stuff, your address, proof of address. All the stuff that the class um, gave you, and like your parents stuff or whoever is your little instructor or whatever, instruct them. And then basically, yeah, that's about it. You don't take no test. Oh yeah, that's another good thing about Texas Driver School. I come. When you get, you know, how people be saying a uh, permit test or whatever. You don't have to take one at the DMV when you do Texas Driver School. I come because all of the tests or quizzes is in the online course so when you get to the dmv you don't have to worry about sitting in front of real people and taking a test you get to take your test on your online course in your house where you comfortable in so yeah I, when i went there i didn't have to take no course i just gave them my paperwork and got my uh, learner's license my permit oh yeah y'all by the way you gotta have all your stuff i recommend reading the packet and actually or or calling or whatever but y'all you have to have all your freaking information if not you get sent on because it took me like four tries to get my freaking learners license because there was always something going on and them damn people was rude too so yeah i really hope y'all actually listen to what i'm saying because you don't want to be like everybody else freaking driving illegal go get your permit because that's one big step to getting your license at texasdriverschool.com. The courses are easy. Pay attention. Get your um, all the information you need. Take to the DMV. The bonus got your license. It's that simple, y'all. Because I really enjoyed it. Uh, I did everything on my time. I did it while I was in school, too. So, like, during school, after school or whatever, I would come work on my texasdriverschool.com. I say, like, every other day I would work on it. And your girl got her permit. You know, your girl finna get her license in a minute. So stay tuned for that video. But yeah, y'all. Make sure y'all go to TexasDrivesGood.com and get your permit. And y'all let me know down below. If anything I said was helpful to y'all or like if I gave y'all a good online course to go do, which I think I did. But y'all, everybody's opinion is different. So I'm not just going to say, yeah, this is great, whatever. To me, it's great, and then I already recommended it to other people, so I hope they think it's good. But yeah, here's my permit, y'all. My picture, let me show y'all my picture if I can. And if I'm ashy, don't mind it, I just got the sub. That's me, your girl. <laughs> Period. Oh yeah, okay. Also, when you get your permit, you get to drive in the car with somebody else that has their license that's over 25. Yeah, if you have somebody to have a license that's over 25, you can drive with them all the time, anytime you want. And after you get your permit and you start driving and stuff, you don't have to fill out this information thing that tell you like hours to drive, what to work on. You have to fill that out. I think it's like, and you have to drive at night too. So yeah, if you need glasses or whatever, get your glasses because they will be giving you an eye test at the dmv to make sure you know you good to drive and if you have glasses like me uh what did i do did i have my glasses on when i was doing it 
I don't remember. But you look in this thing and then you tell them whatever. And then you're going to get your restriction. I think it's restriction A. That means you have to wear your corrective lenses while driving. So, And I think I told y'all everything I went through and everything y'all need to do. Because it wasn't really that much stuff y'all need to do. Y'all just need to go on the um, online and start. That's basically it. Start. Oh, yeah. The price for the one, if you want to do it by yourself on your time without your parents or whatever, it was seventy dollars to start, y'all. The price for me was seventy dollars, yeah. But if you wanna, and, and if you wanna do it with your parent, it's seventy dollars too. And if you're over eighteen, it's like thirty dollars. And then if you're over eighteen, you don't have to get a permit. So I'm guessing you do that and you can get your license. I think I don't know about if you're over eighteen, but I know from fourteen to seventeen, you go do the course, you get your permit, you go do the drive you need to do. Oh yeah, you have to keep your permit for six months six months you have to keep your permit then after that six months you are eligible to go get your license and yeah i think that's about it y'all so this is for all y'all that don't have no license young thinking you don't you can't get one well you can go to texasjobschool.com you can get your license period well your permit for now you know so this is for everybody go get your license if you're grown if you're not grown go get your freaking permit because that's a big big step to get your license you know and yeah don't try to be like all your friends driving illegal and encourage them to get their license too because i'm sure you don't want to be the only one driving around because i don't and i'm right after i get done making this video i'm finna send it to my friends you know you know and i already put my the friends that asked me about it i put them on already but i'm finna go send this to the rest of my friends so you send this to your friends to all y'all go get y'all permit and then get y'all license period anyway i think that's all for this video if you haven't already subscribed to my channel like this video and comment down below any other video suggestions y'all want me to do because i take every comment to consideration so if you comment down below a video most likely is going to get done okay so yeah comment down below and your girl jk is out